Hi everyone, Barb Langlois here. You already know from looking at my website that leadership is my focus. What I'd like to share with you here though are some personal leadership qualities that will help you expand your leadership capacity. You may have already read or know from reading about me that I believe that in order to be a good leader we have to develop ourselves first because if we can't lead ourselves we certainly can't lead others. So I've got here behind me five qualities that I'd like to share with you on how to become or how to enhance your personal leadership ability. So number one here is your relationship with yourself. If you don't have a good relationship with yourself, meaning are you always kind of looking for things to go wrong? Are you talking to yourself in your head with a negative slant? I'm not very good. I'm, I'm lousy at keeping my word. Then you don't have a very positive relationship with yourself. So you need to change that. You need to have a good, positive relationship with yourself. Number two, responsibility. What I mean by that is are you taking responsibility for how you show up? Or are you looking to blame the person closest to you? If only they would do things differently, your life would be wonderful. Or your leadership skills would be phenomenal if only they would do something different. You've got to start to take responsibility for how you show up in the workplace. Number three. Humor. We all know that when we laugh, we relax. When we laugh and relax, we become creative. When we're creative, we can think of new ways to do other, or new ways to do things that we've done before that aren't working. A belly laugh is a great way to enhance your creativity and to relax your shoulders. What I find is so many people are so serious in the workplace. I know people who hush up others who are laughing. We've got to learn to laugh sometimes and have a little bit of fun. So bring some humor back into your life. Number four. Ooh, compassion. What I mean by compassion, and I've already written an article on that, is that it's one of those big skills that we have to develop for ourselves before we can give out to others. Meaning we have to have self-compassion for the the foibles, if that's a word, you know those errors that we make or sometimes those perpetual habits we have that we may not like about ourselves, have some self-compassion. And when we do that, when we have compassion for ourselves, it's that much easier to have compassion for other people. And finally, the fifth quality that will help you develop your personal leadership skills, thereby enhancing your leadership capacity is, save the best for last, integrity. You've got to have integrity. Do you do what you say you will do? Do you know that when you make a promise to somebody deep down inside that you'll keep that to the best of your ability? Or do you know when you make it that you're not really going to keep it? In order to develop yourself into a great leader, you have to have integrity with yourself and then with others. Keep your word. It's your most powerful tool. So there you have it. Five personal leadership qualities that will help you enhance your leadership capacity. Bye for now.